in the UK. The judges dress in black. Every dignitary in America, in the UK, when they drive in their convoys, every car is black. Can you tell me why? Do you want to know why? Do you want to know why? Because black is power. Do you understand this? Black is power. So when I see a black man, like our Excellency President Jame, doing what he's doing, defying all the odds of the colonial masters, they don't like that. They don't like that. But here where Peter tell them, say, I don't care if you like it or not, we Africans love it. Let me tell you something. Is His Excellency President Jame, he's not a normal man. These type of people don't come around every day. They are like once in a lifetime type of people. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? If you understand me, say yes, Rasta. Now listen good. Our Excellency President Jame. If I'm saying it wrong, I'm sorry. I cannot say His Excellency because it belongs to us. So I say our Excellency. He's so excellent. Our Excellency President Jame is a man of God. A son of God. He's a man for the people. You understand? Now what I want from each and every Gambian first before I can ask any other African or any other black man I want all Gambians to rightfully, truthfully, consciously defend the life of this man by any means necessary. We will not stand aside and let them fight this man just like that. No. You see what they did to Marcus Gavi? You see what they did to Malcolm X? You see what they did to Martin Luther King? Them now do that to President Jame. Never. So here what I say. I can sing for you all night, but it's not just about singing. I have to talk with you. I don't get this chance every day. Before I go into that song, I'm going to give you a quick story. And show you that the forces of evil did not want me here in Gambia. I'll tell you why. Two days before I was supposed to fly out of America to the Gambia, my vehicle was robbed. Everything was stolen from me. My computers, all my musical equipment, my passport to travel was stolen. I called my road manager in the UK. I said, look, my passport is stolen. I called Master Lion, who was on the grounds here in the Gambia. I said, my passport has been stolen. I didn't tell him I wasn't coming. Granted, I did not know if I would make it because when you lose a passport in the United States, it takes at least 90 days to get it back. Now, to show you that the forces of evil did not want me to witness this prosperity. But they can't stop it. Because two days after they stole the passport, some people in the State Department of America they did everything in their power to help me to receive a new passport. And here I am in the Gambia today. And I wouldn't miss this opportunity for nothing. Not only because I love the people of the Gambia. But I love my favorite dish. Red snapper fish. Bullet style. This is my favorite food. I love bullet. It's wonderful. Now, people, remember this. What the Most High has in store for you, no evil power can fight it. No evil power can stop it. I tell people everywhere I go in the world, I am not just a Jamaican. I am not just an American. I am an African. 
And better yet, I am a Gambian African. Easy. Find yourself. Gambian African. Music. Master Lion. Come now, man. You see how I tell you about the forces of evil? The song that I'm supposed to sing to you, you don't want me to sing it. Skelly, talk to me now. Are we ready? Let's get it. Hey! Ah, 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 ah. Yambia, I want you to sing this song. Hey! A man is still a man. When I didn't wear jackets and tie, I remember I'd be a fool. The only difference is when I knew I even. Oh, yeah, yeah. A man is still a man. When I didn't wear jackets Grandpa! 